Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to go over my rim fishing setup. Now this is a $20 rod and reel setup, and honestly you can find one for cheaper, like $5 at a flea market. But for the money, this is an awesome piece of equipment to have in your arsenal, and it's the only brim rod I have right now because I didn't want to spend too much money getting into brim fishing at first. So this is what I have, it's a Bass Pro Micro Light Plus Rod and Reel Combo, and it's phenomenal. It's a five foot rod, a two ball bearing reel, and they just seem to work very well together. One thing that really drew me to this rod was how uh, finicky is it at the end. It's a very soft point, so very little wrist movement to make the tip move around quite a bit, which is very good for little jigs and whatnot. You don't have to put as much effort into it, something I really like. Now, although this rod is rated for between 1 and 16 ounce jig heads and 3 8 I'll throw a little bit more sometimes, and then I'll throw 132 uh, ounce jig heads with a little soft plastic on them. But although you're not going to get the distance, you're only going to get about 10 to 12 yards, maybe 15 if you really try to chunk it out there. Uh, it, it gets it done if you're in that close proximity. Otherwise, I'll throw a 1 16 so you get a little bit more distance. Now, what I usually use this for, 95% of the time, is with live bait. So I'm going to use a little cork with a piece of lead in it to give me that little extra casting distance. Plus, it helps keep the cork uh, upright. Uh, a little, about two feet of line, you're going to use a little shot BB right above a size six or foot or four um, Aberdeen hook. And that's been my main setup for crickets and things of that nature. I've had very good uh, success with those. And I've cut a lot of rim with that type of uh, setup right there. So this is a very good uh, live bait rod. That's usually what I've used before. The next one I buy is probably going to be a little bit more for artificial. However, I can hook it up with live bait if I really want to. Now, this great setup for twenty dollars. It's a little heavy on the back end, but overall fairly light. You can definitely fish with it all day. It's just a little bit heavier, not incredibly well balanced. But for twenty bucks, what am I going to argue about? It's worked for years, it's been very durable, none of the eyelets have cracked or have uh, been popped out, anything of that nature. And this thing has been pushed against trees, got caught in limbs, everything else, because I use this usually in the woods uh, whenever I take it fishing. But I would definitely suggest uh, checking this out, it's what I use, and I would suggest y'all using it as well if you're just wanting to get into it and you're not really sure about brim fishing yet. Anyway guys, this has been Buck Creek and I have been showing you the Micro Light Plus Bass Pro Shop Rod and Reel Combo. If you have any questions, make sure to ask me on either the comments or I have some links in the description below where you can add me on social media. Feel free to message me, I promise to message y'all back. Uh, it's something I really enjoy and plus I can't do anything else right now besides sit around. So, might as well answer a few questions if you don't have any. But that's it for me. Thanks for watching.